G'day mates, welcome to 4th Dimensional Gaming. I am your host, Cranky Nerd, and this is Evil Land 2. Now before we get started on this game, there's a reason why we're doing this, rather than something else. Originally, I was uh, going to be putting up GTA, some GTA videos, but then, while I was recording some GTA videos, my computer, um, exploded. And when I mean exploded, I mean BANG! Uh, loud sound and uh, smoke. Well, there wasn't any smoke, but there, there, <laughs> there could have been if I didn't put turn the power off quick enough. The whole room could have caught on fire or something. Um, but yeah, uh, and also I would have putting been putting up more King's Quest quest episodes. I had about like five episodes of that ready to upload and put up onto the channel. I had depth videos. I had Left 4 Dead videos, all of that, on my computer. Now, news is so far, the hard drives should be fine, at least it's what the computer people say at the store, they're gonna double check it and all that, but they sent it off to go give me a quote. I probably could fix it myself, but I can't really be bothered to be honest, got other things to do. But. I saw this game, and I remember the first game of Evil Land, and it was a pretty good game. So I thought I'd show it to you guys and see if you guys would like it as well. Now, whether or not I'm doing a full-fledged series on this, I don't know. The original idea was to kind of have a series. This goes back to the game a bit thing. Have a sort of series that goes on from game to game, where I just play a bit of a game to show you what it's like and see if you guys would like to play it yourself. That's that sort of thing. So um. I'll probably just play about 15 to 20 minutes, maybe a bit more than that, just to get the gist of the ideas to show you guys the game. Um, that might not give you the full experience. Depends on how much I like it. It might turn into a series. I don't know. This is just to fill in the void while I get things sorted with the, the, the main computer. Anyways, uh, <laughs> let's get started. Uh, MV slot. Uh, a slight ca case of... Oh, I'm guessing this is the, uh, this is the difficulty setting, so I'm just going to go classic. Um, okay. Oh, let's move this mouse out of the way. Uh, hang on a, a minute. Oh no, this is it. This is all good. Okay, for a second I thought the resolution was messed up, but no, it's just the game. Uh, oh, yeah, oh, so you noticed the, uh, the webcam. Thought I'd give it a shot. Um, tell me if you like it or not. Hello, G! Uh, do I press enter? What do I... What do I press? Um... What do I... What do I press? It doesn't tell me what do I press. Oh! Spacebar! Okay. <laughs> we are going to begin our daily psychological training session. Alright. When you hear the buzzer, move to the right. Oh yes! I did it! Congratulations! You've achieved nothing! Alright. <laughs> On with the exercises! When you hear the buzzer, move to the left! Now, do we really need this tutorial? I understand how games work. Well done! Now you look like a stupid idiot who doesn't know how to play video games! Uh, up at the ceiling and down at the floor! Wait, how are you meant to look up at... Oh, that! Right, okay. Very good, sir! It's like you played video games before! You should now feel the overwhelming urge to leave this room! I have the overwhelming urge to punch you in the face for expecting that I don't know how to play a video game. Come on, in this day and age, are tutorials really necessary? Perfect G, very good! Is that my name? G? I'm all G? That's my name? Now look for... that's... That, that says father, not further, father, I would say further, but anyway, oh look there's some plants like from Pokemon, excellent G, as you can see, shrubs are blocking your way, in a normal case scenario like real life, you could walk straight through them, or chop them down or brush them aside. You should feel an irrational desire to chop them down with a sword. Okay. Okay. See, I knew that was going to happen. We have provided you. Okay. 
What? What's my attack button? Uh, oh, there we go. F. F's my attack button. Congrat! See, I can figure this out myself by pressing keys on the keyboard. Congratulations! You are quite pleased to have chopped down those shrubs. Not really. It wasn't that much of a task, to be honest. As a reward, we will put on some relaxing music. Oh, how nice of them. Can I... Can I move? Ah, good! You appreciate this music. I actually do appreciate the music. It's quite nice. It was a bit silent, to be honest. Continue on your way! I shall. Oh, what? They turned off the relaxing music. Um, in short, in short fight. Okay, okay, this is uh, pretty Ow. simple. Ow! Die, you crazy creatures! Are they tentacles? Oh, they ro robots. I don't know what these are. Ow! 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 Ow. Die, you damn pesky creatures of the night! Die! Where's that relaxing music? I want that music to come back. You're pleased with your fight? No. Once again, it wasn't that much of a task. Come on. Okay, these guys look like they'll pack a punch. So that's him. He passed all the tests with flying colours. Yes, he's just right for the task. We'll be entrusting to him. I certainly hope you're right. A single misstep could bring about the end of time itself! Oh, that wouldn't be too good. Rest assured, Professor. We've choked and double- Oh, not choked. We we've checked and double checked! Everything will be processed and planned. Okay. Good. Then we'll be able to start act- We'll be able to activate the machine. Make the necessary preparations. Yes, Professor. Oh, I don't know if that was the female or not. But who cares? Who cares? Oh no, it, oh no, it's an explosion. Oh dear. What's happened? Ah, oh, I'm so tempted to do a series on this. Oh my, suddenly... A long time ago, the Mangai civilization had dis discovered great secrets. No one knows how exactly, but it disappeared soon after that, marking the beginning of a new era. Ooh. In the year 950, Humans and demons fought a merciless war. The human empire won at a great cost. This is very interesting. Fifty years later, the city of Genova is preparing the remembrance ceremony of that victory. But not everything is as peaceful as it seems. For in the darkness was the flaming monocle! <laughs> no, no. Uh, uh, reference, by the way, that's uh, another dude in the WUG community. Um, I'm, am I the dude sleeping in the bed here? I must be the dude sleeping in the bed. Wakey, wakey. Oh, you're awake. Are you feeling better? Wow, I just made her sound like an old granny. My father found you passed out deep in the forest. You don't remember anything? Not even your name? Not even my pretty eyes? <laughs> Maybe if you wandered around the forest, that will help jog your memory by the way I didn't introduce myself my name is uh your name is Fina apparently but no that is not your name this is going to be uh your name is going to be uh 
Hmm. Interesting. What is your name gonna be? Uh, I will call you... Oh, I know. I'll call you B. I'll call you B. Because that's one of my fans. B. There we go. You're B. There we go. A little shout out to B. There you go. I hope you'll remember everything quickly. I'm sorry about the horrible female voices. I cannot do them at all. There. <laughs> I'm not a- I'm not a girl, okay? I can't do that. Oh, wow, there's a chest chest over here. I instantly wanna- What? You can't put a chest here and not- uh, not let me open it? That's just crazy! It's in a video game! Can I go through here? A, a fire. Must be nice in the winter. Can I go to bed? Uh, no, I just- I just- I did just get out of bed. Uh, let's go- let's go out. Obviously, since we named that character, she's probably gonna be a- a running character. Unless they just did that for jokes. What a nice little town we have here. Um, hello? This village is so boring. I would would have loved to live at the time of the Emperor's Lothair. Who knows, maybe I could have been a general in his army and fought demons. Nope, you're just a pathetic little villager. You could have never done that. Um, you're hopeless. Go die in a hole. <laughs> Whoa, that turned dark quickly. <laughs> Oh, uh, hello. This inn was built shortly after B's grandfather founded the village. We welcome any traveller who wants to rest here. Well, except demons, of course. No way is one of them gonna set foot in my place. Okay. Um. Oh! A chest that I can open. Now, how am I meant to know a chest that you can open and a chest that you can't open? That's a bit annoying. I guess you just go up to it and find out yourself. This game is so beautiful, even though it's like pixely. It's... and the music, it's so calming. Oh, it's an old man fishing! Hello, Mr. Old Man. How's it going? Can I talk to you? What a nice day to fish in peace! With nobody around to bug me! Well, almost nobody. Except for you, you little whippersnapper! Get out of here! <laughs> Uh, who's this? Can I... Don't you dare tell me... Tell B this, but I'm kind of jealous of her. I mean, she's the chief's daughter, and she's so sweet and full of life. And apparently she has magical powers. Magical powers? Burn her at the stake! She's a witch! <laughs> oh my. Although her whole family is a... You know, these female voices, I'm not gonna even bother with it. Okay? I tried my hardest at the female voices. It, it, it actually hurts my voice to try and do the female voices. Uh, this is a plantation I can't enter. Can I, can I enter this place? No? Of course I can't. So that's the inn. I have no idea where I'm meant to go. To the forest? To the forest. Uh, forest, forest. Where is the forest? Is there a menu? Inventory? Tab? No, nothing. Okay. Uh, be careful, monsters started overrunning the forest yesterday. Since it's become so dangerous, you should find yourself a weapon before going there. But didn't I just have a weapon a second ago? Or was that just a dream? Maybe it was just a dream. A dream that was a tutorial, which I don't need. Is this a store? Hey, this dude looks like he's dressed up as some kind of furry. Am I right? He looks like a furry. B is worried, but sure to thank her when you get the chance. Uh, wish to go into the forest, take the path that crosses. Yes, 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 yes. I need the store. Where is the store? And then these are all houses. So this is a. Can I steal your fruit? I want to take all your all your plants and make them mine. Um. Can I take this path? Where does this lead? What's this place? It looks like some kind of. Okay. This door is closed, you're not allowed in here. Um, okay. So I guess... I guess I'll try and find this door and buy a sword with the coins I found in the inn. Uh, which is only five coins, I'm not sure if that's enough. That's the inn. And this is the store. Okay. 
Welcome to everything under the sun. Here you'll find everything under the sun. Except I don't know, have anything to sell at the moment. The road to the Empire's capital was blocked by a rock slide. It will probably be a few more days before they clear it out. Yes, I know, another rock slide. It's like they happen every other day. Are you looking for a weapon to go out into the forest? There may be one in the old house northeast of the village. I don't know why I didn't take it myself to sell to you, but it's been abandoned since. I'd rather not talk about it for now. Try to track down the old man Paul, he's got the key. But watch yourself, he's not the most easygoing sort, especially if you bother him while he's fishing. I already have bothered him while he's fishing. Can I, can I steal your stuff or is it all empty? It's all empty. Okay. That was my horrible attempt at trying to do some Indian or Arabic accent. I don't know. But <laughs> it'll do. Okay, old man. I need to bother you. Uh, might have it or not. How about you do me a favor in return? Of course. Of course I'll do your old favor, you old scrungy bastard. Um, <laughs> whoops. Oh. Uh, I have this fish-related issue I can't seem to solve. Maybe a young fella like yourself could help me out. Uh, number one, fishing rods. My fishing rods are all tangled up. I can't tell one from another. Each time they cross, follow the line that goes left or right. Okay, which rod should I use to catch that fish? Well... The orange one is what I'm gonna say. It's c oh no! I thought you were smarter than that. Okay. Blah 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 blah. Yeah 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 yeah. No! Fail! 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 No! No! Fail! Come on! I don't understand the puzzle. I didn't actually mean to click on it. Right. So, my fishing rods are all tangled. Each time they cross, follow the line that goes left or right. Oh. Okay, so, it's not that one. It's not that one. Okay, so, right. Left. Left. It can't, can't possibly be that one. But, I'll give it a shot. What? Can't I just, you know, like, try, uh, you know what, I'm just going to try every combination. I'm going to be, like, doing it the old cheaty way. <laughs> yeah, la, 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 I don't really care, okay? And, uh, boom. Wrong. Really? Oh, no, right! Yeah! The old try every combination trick. Yay, I got a key! And I think this is about a good time as any to, you know, stop the recording. And, you know what? I'm probably going to do a real whole series on this. Um, I would have liked to continue the King's Quest one, but this is just to fill in the spa space while I get everything all set up. And hopefully that hard drive's okay, which the, the news so far is it's most likely going to be okay. But anyways, I have been Cranky Nerd. Please give this video a like and, you know, you know, just because I'm awesome. No, I'm not going to be that smug about myself. Anyways, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I've been Cranky Nerd and you guys have been great mates. Bye!